Hi everybody, it's Julie and I'm back. I'm going to go ahead and work on my day one. And if you recall, day one is the day that our neighbor moved out and our new neighbor moved in. <laughs> so I have, I have a little bit of an idea. I have some random items that I have been, I mean, I have a lot of random items that I've been keeping, but I had this card from a neighbor and I just really liked it because it's these doors and I thought that that would be really fun to work with because, you know, well, it's going to be a new neighbor, new neighbor and so doors anyway. And then I have these from the Tim Holtz collection and I thought they would be funny with this and um, so the first thing I want to do is I need to cover the um, this and I have this joy paper now this was a regular like a little notepad and I have taken and added the glue the glitter glue or no nail polish or glitter glue one or the other to this I did it a long time ago so I still have that and so okay okay it doesn't quite cover it um, so one I have a bunch of things over here a pile of random things and um, I have this this is from when I was showing you how to make the holly um, and I thought I I think I can just go ahead and add that. So first of all, that's the first thing I'm going to do. I'm going to add this. I'm just going to put some glue on it. And cover the Mr. and Mrs. Fisher. So you know, it's a junk journal. I'm using cards. This is actually from a couple years ago. This was my other neighbor that moved away. It's now been two years ago. Okay. So. I just folded it so that it would stay. Stop hitting me. <laughs> okay. And I'm going to go ahead and. I have this is a little bit off and that was to be able to cover and then this is going to go um, over the other way now let's see how are we going to do this we have this then I have this a Christmas to remember I thought that that might be kind of funny to be putting on here where the there it is there and then I'm gonna want to be able to put the story so I could make this a pocket and put the story inside here or I could make this the pocket and put the story in the side no I'll put the story in behind the we'll, so we'll go ahead and I'll put the story behind the card when I put the card in the okay. so today I am wearing my strawberry shortcake sweatshirt that my children bought me in 2002 um, my nickname for many, from many people is shortcake. I'm five foot tall. I was always short. <laughs> so, um, a couple of people in high school nicknamed me that, and some still call me that. And then that was my my chat name when I was in the single parents chat room back in that time. So my kids saw this and got it for me and they bought it in the junior section so it <laughs> even with my shortness it's uh 
it's short it's it's cold it says it was 18 here um, I took picture of the what we call the temperature clock my granddaughter when she was like three well, what does the temperature clock say she said so now she's 14 and I say temperature clock okay so I'm just gonna go ahead and put picture of the neighbor's car pulling up or parked in front of what is now their house And I have to admit, I was quite surprised <laughs> when she pulled up, or actually when I looked out and there was a hers in the in the front yard. Um, you know, I was watching all morning to see the new neighbor pull up. I knew they were coming. Okay, so we have that, and let's make sure it's, I don't know how or why we have a bubble there, but oh well. Okay, so now you might have noticed I have a headband or a, this is actually a corsage box or a candy box holder, um, holding down the other pages so they don't keep flipping open. And, um, let's see. So if I was going to write on the card, just deciding whether I want it to come out the top or out the side. I think we'll go without the top. Okay, so we need to move this over. And go ahead and put glue at the edge around the three sides. So, so today is the the twenty fourth. Yeah, it's the twenty fourth. So that gives us seven more days to finish this book. Um, so there will probably be at least, well, there will be at least one video every day, and some days there will be two on, um, on making this, this book. So I hope you are enjoying this series. And getting ideas and possibly even working on your book and getting it done. That would be the best. So at the end of this, what we will do is um, I will have in the, the big room, in the scrap all about it, I will start a thread and you can put... Um, a file or you can put we'll do an album and we'll do a thread where you can put if you've made a video of your December daily your finished December daily you're going to be able to put it in there and your pictures um, and or if you just do pictures that's fine and you can put those in there and um, what I will do is I will draw a name from the people that participate and do their December daily. You know, even if you already did it in December, you, you're going to be able to post it there. It will give us some more um, 
some more uh, inspiration, and um, I think it'll be kind of fun. So I think what I'm going to do, since I have this little house, I like this that says Holly Jolly, this card. And, you know, to me, this says new neighbor. Now, if I can get this, darn, it's not, it's not on here right. It's not sticking anyway. Because I was thinking if I could get it so that this can come down and it will help keep these doors closed that that would be like totally awesome so I'm gonna go ahead I'm just taking this sticker off and go over here I happen to have these these are from bottle caps so, um, I had bought some bottle caps from, well, I got gifted a whole bunch of bottle caps. And, um, and then whenever I use them and I don't use the, the little thing, I save, I save it. <laughs> Imagine that, Julie saving something. Okay. Ooh, careful over there. This is not sticking. Okay, because, let's make sure there's no glue on here. There is. Okay, now we need something to go down in there. Sorry, I'm, I'm going to find us something wonderful. <laughs> over here. There's this card. It has music notes on it. Kind of, I was like, should I save the music notes for have another thing coming up that's definitely going to use music. Notes. Okay, so I'm just going to stick this on here and then I'm going to put it down. There we go. And hopefully that will help keep that closed. It will. Okay. So I like that very much. Next we have our tag over here and the tags are all similar but they have other things on them. Like this one has the holly. This one has a present. Um, so I want to use them as they are. But I need to, I want to decorate them. So I had received these in a, a random act of kindness. And I said I was going to use these in my book. And I'm going to. So I'm going to. I think I'm going to put the, use that. And then I, I, you hear me talk about using something to, to kind of tie the album together. So I think there's like 12 of these in here. So, um, I'll be able to do like every other page or every couple of pages, um, one of these. And then I thought I would use these washi tapes. And I got these at Michael's. I think I got them after Christmas. I might have got them, like, I don't remember. But I, um, I really like the thin washi tape. 
you, you notice that a lot of times I cut washi tape to make it smaller. So I'm just going to go ahead and put down a piece of the little poinsettia. And then, oh, we've got to start this one. And then a little piece of this green that has the poinsettia. So that gives us that look there. And I don't know if this is, ah, it's a sticker. Hooray. Didn't, probably says that right on him. <laughs> okay. So there we go. And you could make this look a little more like a poinsettia by um, crinkling this inside piece if you wanted to. Okay, these sides are glued down. So there. Okay, so there is our tag. And of course we could put it over here and it would help close that, but then we wouldn't be able to get in it, so we won't do that could go up at the top. We'll see. We've got our tag decorated. So the next thing we have is the empty chairs. And um, so again, we have another piece of this. If we go, we could go in the center. It's different because we do have. I really want to put these on. Okay, and I want to see those beer cans because that's an important little part of that page. I can't even begin to tell you how much we miss her. She she only moved to the other side of our little tiny, tiny town, but it's way different than having her right across the street. Way different. And she's also our doggy nanny. She watches our doggies when, our, when we go out of town or go to see our grandkids or anything like that. So... So with that, we miss her too. Like going, you know, this this could hang up off the top. It, that would be okay. Um, it's kind of fun to have the tags off the top. So this could, and it could all, it could collage. We could collage this. I like this down here, and I like this. I I want it to do that though, so I'm gonna go ahead and cut across. Cut it across. Okay, so it can hang off. I'm okay with it hanging off. In the middle off in the middle. Okay. Okay. So do this and then you can write the story there. So I'm gonna go ahead and glue down the tag. Decided what to the side because there we go. Because we can um, 
write the story to the side maybe. Okay. So this is pretty much centered and it's about a half an inch below. And this was a Rolodex card or a memory dex card that I cut out using my memory dex die. And then I painted this back in July when I was um, when I was doing the Christmas in July series. And one of the things that I showed was how to make um, how to do the, the holly painting that I like to do. So very, very simple. Um, you can find that probably in the Christmas embellishment playlist. If I can, I'll see if I can find it and I'll put it down below. It's a very simple thing. I actually, um, would do that on my fingernails with uh, four different fingernail polishes. So two different colors of green, a red, and then gold glitter. This would be better with real pictures on photo paper. But I needed to be able to start this today, and I don't want to drive into town. We don't have a place here in our little town that does um, photo processing. Because at this point, I would have even gone and <laughs> paid the the dollar, the hour, fee, you know, get it done in an hour. But I just really don't want to go into town. that up. Okay, so thought this was funny, naughty and nice. So we had this and then a little while later there was four chairs five ch four chairs in the garage because our friend Carolyn came over and when Vicki was done showing Daphne around the the house and all of the how things work um, and so we all, we were all sitting in the garage That's my day one. Um, I will I will add my journaling and um, tell the story. So you know I messed this up here. Probably should put something there from out of the out of the vast stash that we have going on over here. But what?
Too bad that wasn't pointing the other way. That would be funny. that And I'm okay with putting something this thick down here because we have this that's going to be pretty thick up here. tag shows through from the top. So we'll want to put something in it. Um, I have this. This was from when I cut the, the, the top part of this big last or big um, lace and we'll just go ahead and put this through. That will give us, you know what, that's really big. We can go ahead and cut that in half, probably. Yeah. So we're going to cut it in half. There we go. It's hard to do from this angle. Okay, try this again. Go through. There's a loop here. Let's pull the two through the loop. Both of them. There we go. Oh yeah, much better. Now I can um, also, for more interest, I can hang something from that too. But we'll we'll see as we go along. So um, the cover page for the cover page, I will be looking for a picture of me and Tom that will go on this page, and um, and then probably. I will add this December like this and it'll be on this page actually I'm going to put that in there now and I think this came out of the Tim Holtz ephemera package that I had gotten I just want to Okay, so I've just glued it across the bottom, and that way um, the picture will be able to go underneath if it's if it's that big. Because I do have I have this picture, but this is from 
the uh, Fisher family Christmas. So it'll go on day 16. But it could go. It might. It may end up being the one that goes here. So, and I like to do this this see-through look. Um, I've done it before in my books. So there is day one, and I hope you enjoyed that. So, I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. If you like this video, please. Give it a thumbs up if you have any comments, questions, or suggest just suggestions. Put them down below. Find something to celebrate every day. Don't forget to subscribe. And I will probably come back and do some stamping or um, stenciling on this at the end of the book. Probably. That's how I've been doing my stamping and stenciling is at the end. So have a great day. Bye.